Hi, it's me, Douglas, Favro product expert. Today, we will be covering templates. What are they? How can you find them? And how can you create templates? Now in Favro, we have three types of templates, card, board, and collection. Let's take a look at card templates. Now we have a simple board with a card called project. And inside we do have some checklists, tables, numbers, and even attachments. Now, all of that can be saved as a template to be reused multiple times on bigger or same projects or tasks that are reoccurring each time. Now, we can also choose to include even fields to be saved on the template. So project type, let's choose internal. And we also added a tag called campaign. Now, in order to create a card template, we would need to open up the menu of the card and choose the option add to templates. Now in this menu, we can actually choose the name of the template and how do we want to share this either with only yourself, the whole organization or specific members or groups. So let's choose the whole organization and let's call this project board. Great. Now, in order to apply the card template, there are two options how you can do that. First, if we go to the board options and choose more, there is an option called set card templates. So in here, we can choose from the template that have been created before and the one that I've just created, project board, here we go. Now in this menu, you can also choose to delete those templates by simply pressing the pen icon to edit and then choose to delete here. Now, the second option, how you can set up the car template on the board is via the automation. So if we go to the automations menu and create a custom, we can actually choose that when a card is created or different actions done, apply a card template. And we can choose a specific card of our choosing or a template that we just created. Project board. You can see how that works. If I'll create a new card, the card has already added the tag of a project type internal. And if we open it up, you can see that the content inside the card has also been applied via the template with all the information intact. So that's the card templates. Now let's take a look at board templates. Board templates can also be saved via the option menu in the board, then choose more and then save as a specific boards template. Now we do have a board in the sheet view. So this is going to be a sheet template. Again, the same menu. We call this board project template. And let's choose to save it for the whole organization. Great. Now, in order to apply the template, you just simply can create a new board, choose the same type that you've saved it for. So this is going to be a sheet. Below, you can see all the templates we have created. Also, we have our board project template. We also have Fabro predefined templates that you can use. Let's choose board project template. And here you go. All the cards with the content inside. And the setup of the board is the same. Now, if you would like to delete a board template, you can do that also by accessing the option where you chose the template. But in this case, go to the top for the sharing and more option and just choose to delete the template. Now, the third option is the collection templates. And to create it, you just simply go to the top of the collection. Choose the additional options, save as a template. Again, the same setup as before, the name, collection project board, visibility, and create. Now, in order to apply collection templates, you would need to go to the sidebar menu and choose the plus sign to create a new collection. But in here, we will choose the template gallery. Here you can see all of your created collection templates. 
and also Favre created templates. And let's choose collection project board. Let's choose the name and visibility. And here we go. You have a full collection with boards and cards predefined via the template. And that's it. Hope this helped you a lot and good luck using Fabro.